new products. <laughs> I'm that's Nathan and welcome back to my video. I have some new hair products for you. If you remember from a little while ago, I done a video about De Wax, which was like this insane wax that I'm still using now. I absolutely love it. It's just perfect for your hair. It seems to like condition it and make it really good quality, as well as using only the smallest amount and getting an insane hold and style with it. I love it. Well, the same brand, Dude, have brought out a desalt water spray and I am here to review it. So in this video, I'm gonna do the ultimate showdown between Tony and Guy's Men Messy Salt Spray and the Dude Salt Water Spray. Are you two ready to battle it out in the ultimate showdown? Let's go. Round number one, packaging. We're gonna start with Tony and Guy and this is your standard kind of high quality range in a supermarket. It literally just looks like one of those ones that you'd walk past and be like, you know, I'm sure that's fine, but just sort of there. There's nothing fancy about it, but it does look high quality. I will give it that. But when I receive desalt water spray in the post, I was so pleasantly surprised by the packaging. So it comes in this box with this really nice turquoisey blue. So let me remove it from the box to reveal the gorgeous bottle. I think this is absolutely stunning. I love the colour and it just instantly reminds me of what salt water spray should be like. It reminds me of the beach and it's very beachy to me. Yeah, it just looks surfery, cool and fun. This really gives the illusion of a salt water spray. So packaging for just salt water spray really wins for me. Round number two, scent. I'm gonna start with Tony and Guy again and the scent of this. Okay, it's nice. It smells clean. It's very manly. It's very musky, like a men's cologne. Next is the salt water spray. Oh my god, guys. It literally smells like a beach. It's got like that coconut creamy pina colada maybe. That is exactly what I want my salt water spray to smell like. This is great. The smell of this is absolutely fine. It is clean. It is a nice manly scent. This gives the illusion that you are on a beach and that is exactly what I want. So hands down, the winner of the smell goes to desalt water spray. Round number three, product. Now the whole point of the product is so that the product actually works. So in this section, I'm gonna show you a side-by-side -side comparison of the two products on my short hair and then I'm gonna show you on a person with long hair. So as you can see on my short hair, I have just towel dried it like I've just got out of the sea and I'm just messing it around with my hands. Maybe for shorter hair, you give two to three sprays. Honestly, guys, I can't get over the smell of just salt water spray. It is incredible. It gives that whole beachy vibe. As you can see, they both give a nice messy look, but I must say just salt water spray gives a much nicer feeling. I wouldn't say it's a strong hold, but it gives you that hold that it's not gonna move if you don't want it to. It gives you that beach feel. It gives you that straight out of the water feel, which I really, really love. Now onto the longer hair. As you can see, the longer hair has just been towel dried again, like you've just got out of the sea. Both I would recommend maybe four to five sprays just to cover the whole head. And all I'm doing is scrunching it up so that it gives that like loose ringlety look, like you've really just got out of the sea and just sort of really quickly run your fingers through your hair. Again, the hold on them is both fantastic, but I did prefer the look and the feel of desalt water spray. It just gives a much more beachy overall feel to me. With the overall styling of the product, I much prefer desalt water spray. It adds so much volume, so much texture to your hair, which is exactly what you want from a salt water spray. This is fine, it's absolutely great, but it does not add much volume. This, a few sprays of this and your hair is literally like double the volume and double the texture like the texture is what you crave out of a salt water spray and this to me just doesn't give that this on the other hand is by far superior in styling which is what the product is all about round number four the washout one of my biggest things is I hate it when you have to scrub to get the product out of your hair like it should not be that difficult to remove a product we're gonna start with Tony and Guy this was actually very easy to remove this product you put it under the water and give it a good scrub and it was out and the same with the salt water spray it was so easy to get out this one I must admit afterwards it made your hair feel like it was kind of condition. It just makes it feel like your hair's hydrated, but both very easy on the washout. So this is a tie for this round because they were both equally as good as each other. Round number five is price. So at the moment, the Tony and Guy product on Amazon is five pounds for 200 milliliters, which is a very good price for Tony and Guy. They are one of the leading brands in hair care. The salt water spray is a little bit pricier, coming in at 14 pounds on Amazon 
for a 250 milliliters. Now you do get an extra 50 milliliters of product and the product overall is a much higher quality than the Tony and Guy. So you can understand the price tag. So overall, these two have competed five rounds and I can safely say the winner of this showdown is Dassault Water Spray. And I am not just saying that because I got this product sent to me like I did the De Wax. I am saying this because the dude's products are incredible. I honestly cannot stress to you how good these products are. They make your hair feel healthy. They're so easy to like style your hair, which to me, the ease of styling is one of the most beneficial things. From the packaging, to the scent, to the styling itself, and the volume and the texture that it gives you, gives me so many pros towards the price. I know the price is a little bit more expensive than five pounds for the Tony and Guy, but you get what you pay for. This product, the Tony and Guy, is absolutely fine. It just doesn't give as much volume and texture, the packaging isn't as nice, the scent isn't as nice as the salt water spray. Amazing. I highly recommend anyone to get it. I am not saying that the Tony and Guy Men's Messy Salt Spray is a bad product at all. It is not. It's fantastic for the price. But if you want a product that you know is going to be good for your hair, that's going to start with ease, that's going to give you that texture that messy beach look that you want, the salt water spray is the way forward. When I can't be bothered to style my hair that much but I don't want it to be fluffy, this is my go-to product. It is incredible. I really hope you guys enjoyed the ultimate salt water showdown. I really enjoyed filming this video. I want to know what you think of the salt water sprays in the comments below. Do you use salt water sprays? Has this video made you want to buy the salt water spray? I really hope it has because it genuinely is a fantastic product and I am not just saying that. It really is a brilliant product. Let me know what you think of it if you've used it in the comments below. And just to top off this video, the lovely people over at Da Dude, I absolutely adore them and their products. They're giving me the opportunity to give you incredible people a chance to get your hands on the salt water spray. All you need to do is make sure you have thumbs up this video, make sure you're subscribed to my channel and in the comments below do hashtag Nathan give me the salt. The salt. So hashtag that in the comments below and you head over to my Twitter, you follow me on Twitter and you hashtag me there, spam the hell out of me on all social, like just make sure that you are subscribed, you've thumbsed up this video and I will be checking to see if you have actually done that. So make sure you do. I'll pick across from various social platforms. So make sure you hashtag Nathan give me the salt. I'll put all the links in the description on where you can purchase this item. And I'll also leave a quick description on how you can enter to win one of these, just in case that didn't make any sense to you, because I know I ramble on a bit. Waffling on, that is my thing. But yeah, really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please make sure you give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to leave comments and I'll see you guys in my next video. Are you watching? I hope so. Just salt water spread. Oh.